we have the following parametric equation. What we want to do is find the equivalent rectangular form, and then we're going to graph it. To start off by doing this, what we can do, we need to use substitution because these two equations relate to each other. I'll just go ahead and start with the y. So setting t equal to y, so we have y is equal to t plus 1. What we can do is just subtract 1, so we get t is equal to y minus 1. Now we can substitute this into this equation here. So we get x is equal to, oops, 3y minus 1 plus 2. x is equal to 3y minus 3 plus 6. We end up with x minus 3y. Um, that'd be plus 3, so it's minus, or excuse me, why did I, why did I put plus 6? should be plus 2. And it becomes minus 1, and the move over here it's plus 1 equals 0. But writing this equation out normally, it would be um, y is equal to 1 third x plus 1 third plus one third. Okay, so we can go ahead and graph this. It goes from zero to uh, four. Starting off, starts off at one third, and it's gonna end up at, so four plus x, so that's four over three. Add another one, so we get six over, six over three, or four over three plus one over three equals five over three. So roughly about here. So this graph's gonna look something like this. And I guess you can go ahead and say that this is your equation right here. That's it.